The president-elect spokesperson announced that the nation's top office will be returned to the people before the spring flowers fall and it will be moved to a place closer to the heart of the public. The defense ministry building is looking like the top contender for the new site. Kim hyun sung provides a glimpse of what the office in Yongsan might look like. One of the very first things President-elect Yoon suk yeol has said he will do when taking office is moving that presidential office out of the current Blue House. We want to come out of the Blue House, which has been a symbol of absolute power in Korean history. We want to give that power back to the people. So the president will go into the public and the Blue House will be returned to the people before the spring flowers fall. Several former administrations have promised the same move, but have failed to stick by their word. They cited security and cost problems. But with spokesperson Kim saying that there is absolutely no chance of Yoon taking office in the Blue House, all eyes are on Yoon seok and his transition team to see whether they can deliver where others have failed. Yoon and his team have narrowed down their top two choices to the Foreign Ministry Building in Gwangamun and the Defense Ministry Building in Yongsan. But with the Gwangamun building laced with security concerns and a lack of space, some say that the building in Yongsan is rising as the most likely choice. If the office is moved to Yongsan, this is what it will most likely look like. The office will be surrounded by Yongsan Park, scheduled to be built on the area's former U.S. military base. The park will be open to the public, shortening the distance between the president and the people. For the building itself, an insider to Yoon's team says that the press room will be located on the first floor to open up a stream of communication and to make information more accessible. Some sources say that the plans for the new office were inspired by the White House. The famous Washington building is adjacent to the Lafayette Square and the Ellipse Public Parks. The press room is also housed on the first floor of the West Wing. But even if this historic change happens, Yoon will not be free of the challenges and criticism that have barred other administrations from following through with this move. Already some critics say that Yoon is rushing through with this decision without a fully formed public consensus. Kim Hyun-sung, Arirang News.